You see, tree bark will chew through most anything, but these jeans bite right back. And Levi's blue jeans got a fit that's made for work, and that's real important when the changing room's 200 feet down. <laughs> Levi's are built to last, and it's not just a slogan. They are made and have been from the very beginning with the top quality denim, the buttons, the thread that lasts. We were so confident, we actually had a guarantee um, that if they ripped, we would give you a new pair. It appeared in as early as the 1910s on advertisements. Back in the day, they were originally designed for working men, and some of the working men that used them most frequently were miners. Uh, it made sense. They were tough. Those rivets that were put into the pockets made it so that if you put your hands in your pocket, they weren't going to tear up. And there were also this deep indigo blue, which meant that if you were getting dirt on your overalls, it wouldn't show. We have great stories in the Levi's archives about the strength of our garments including this amazing story by a Detroit area construction worker. While he was working, he fell and the shirt actually caught on the rebar. It ripped down the sides, but it held him in place that saved his life. Our fireproof blue safe is where we keep the most important things in the archives. The most important items we keep in the top here, we watch and control the temperature and the humidity. I love the discovery story of Alf Roberts in the Yukon because it goes back to our 19th century history. The story is that Alf and his wife Marlene own a placer claim uh, up in Yukon territory and when they were digging around in a mine shaft discovered a pair of Levi's 201 jeans. Oh, hello. I'm Rose. I'm going to put my dad, Alfred, online here for you. Can you see us? Okay. Well, uh, the claim we found them on was about 14 miles south of Dawson City. When we opened up the valley, about 20 feet down, they were frozen. Everything's frozen. That's why they didn't uh, rot away. The, the cloth is, is in fairly good shape, but it did have holes. Thank you for your letter and photos. You have a pair of Levi 201 jeans, and they are probably made in the 1898-1899 period. Levi's are really the original sustainable garment, garments built to last. They began with the working class. They would patch them up, pass them on to the next person. So in the Depression era, for instance, people took Levi's, they were tough, and they adapted them to make them work for their present needs. So wearing Levi's for multiple generations or reusing them and repurposing them is something that has been part of our history from the very beginning. Part of the origin story of Levi's was, you know, they were made extra strong. They were a wonderful canvas that any artist could add to. So the summer of love happened. I went to a place called Cherry Avenue Auction, and that's where I bought a pair of used Levi's 501 straight leg. I think I paid 75 cents for them. I know that court quarters were involved. I met a very nice, beautiful, talented woman named Susan my first year at Fresno State, and she sewed most of her clothes in those days, so she had tons of pieces of fabric and whatnot. And so I started appropriating some of those because they were very colorful, often sort of floral patterns over a background color of black or blue or yellow, and those made great looking patches. So I thought, okay, this is my opportunity to really get these jeans held together forever. Denim hunters looking for those great pieces provide the Levi's archives with many items that we have that otherwise would have been lost. For example, items like these were found by the women of Lost Hunt Vintage. Denim just gets better as yeah. you wear it. Mm -hmm. So if you find a piece of denim that's been worn for 50 years, it's going to be a gem like supporting sustainable practices, mm -hmm. which mm -hmm. is vintage, you know? It's like the quality, like these pair of denim jeans, they've lasted over decades. It's like vintage is a great step in that direction, finding clothes, reusing them, especially things like Levi's that last forever. Like these are pieces that you never get rid of. You have those, that pair of pants forever. 
The impact environmentally of Levi's reuse is if you were to observe uh, what people are wearing in just about any place on the earth, you would find that at least half of them are wearing blue jeans. Now, if you take that concept and you apply the idea that those same people were wearing those same blue jeans for their entire life, imagine what an impact that would have on our environment.